Yeah. Did it come as a surprise to you at all? Because even as, as late as a couple weeks ago in Tampa, Jill said when asked if you would be called up, said, no, we're focused on this group right here. Yeah, um, you know, I knew the door was, you know, always cracked. You know, you never, you never know what opportunity will come across um, or, or come to your doorstep. And, um, you know, I always wanted to stay ready. Um, and, and be prepared just in case I did receive that phone call. And I think that, um, you know, just in my natural uh, lifestyle, I love to stay prepared and stay fit and stay healthy and um, obviously be at the top of my game all the time just in case this, this would happen. In the back of my mind, I thought, you know, as long as I stay ready, like, I'll be prepared. And if she needs me, if the team needs me, I'm ready to go. And um, I'm willing to, get, to do that job and uh, fulfill that role, whatever it may be. And so I was obviously hoping for that. It's definitely a dream come true just because because I just needed a toe in the, into the door. And now I feel like um, I can take this opportunity um, and give it my best and, and obviously see what happens. You mentioned that you always wanted to leave that door open with the national yeah. team. You have the World Cup this summer. Mm -hmm. If that opportunity comes, uh, how are you going to approach that? Um, the same as I approach anything. Obviously, I'm taking one day at a time. Um, I can't think too far ahead. Um, it's been two years since I've been back, so I need to just focus on um, being a good teammate, being a good um, person in that environment, um, be a good uh, player, um, perform well, and then we'll start thinking about the next steps. But um, I'm just so excited for the opportunity to be back with the team. I, I would run through a brick wall for this team and the coaching staff. And so. Um, it, it, it's just an honor to, to have that opportunity again. So I don't try and think too far ahead, but I would do what I always do and what I always have done is be professional, um, give it my best, and um, I'm good at what I do, and, and um, I, I will you know, obviously bring that some kind of leadership, uh, new mentality maybe, um, you know, help with the younger players as a veteran as much as I can, and that's what I want to bring. Even though you were hoping and you were ready just in case, mm -hmm. When you saw the number on the phone, what was yeah. what did you react? Um, I was a bit surprised. <laughs> um, you know, sometimes my you know, when I see Jealous's name, it, my heart drops a little bit. Um, but I was also with excitement. You know, I'm, I'm, I told her I'm kind of living in a new space right now. I've grown so much in two years um, as a player, as a person, mentally, emotionally, physically. And I think um, I'm, I'm better than I was obviously two years ago. And so I'm excited to kind of go back into that atmosphere and into that environment kind of as a new person and player and um, with a new mentality and a new goal. And that's what's exciting for me, because I'm not the same person. Uh, I'm better than I was and in all aspects. What day did she call you? That'd be the last one. Um, she called me, let's see, two nights ago. What were you doing? Yeah. Um, I was actually, it was actually right before our, or she texted me first to make sure I had time to speak, um, because we were in the middle of our double day. So I said, uh, I can talk to you in the evening. Um, you know, it was around three in the afternoon or something, two, I don't know, 1.30 or 2, something like that. And I said, well, we have our second session, so I'll talk to you in the evening whenever we, you know, are finished. Did you get any uh, fun reactions from your pride teammates, especially oh gosh, Alex yeah. and Ashlyn? Yeah, I mean, I, they were just so excited. Um, they were really, really happy, and I've heard from all of my teammates, <laughs> really, both on the national team and the pride, um, my coaching staff, former coaches, um, my um, uh, coaching course instructor Carla Thompson and just recently texted me and um, just a lot of family and friends have reached out just congratulating me and obviously the club most importantly so it's just so nice to have that support um, behind me and that just gives me a lot of confidence going into next week.